before I left Springfield, but that top apartment right there, that was my mother-in-law's house before she left, well, before she passed away. So here's the house I lived at, 1209 East Mason. This is the house I lived at before I left to move to Las Vegas. So that window right there, that was my bedroom. And yeah, so that's pretty much it right there. There go Mary! <laughs> did you end up doing last night? Sleeping. Where you were staying at? The hotel? Confident. <laughs> you Sleep a flat like, ass still. Bitch, we ate. We went to Casey's and got some of that pizza. I went oh, to the yeah. chicken shack, got some chicken. When I mean that I was ain't. gone. Ain't <laughs> shit changed. Oh. <laughs> a man on the phone, he said she's still loud as hell too. You drove here? Yeah. Oh my God. All right, I wanted to, um, Show y'all, if they ain't knocked the damn building down, uh, show y'all another place that I used to live at when I was a kid. Now, I lived out here um, when I was in, da -da 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 I want to say sixth, sixth grade, because I was going to Isles. Um, yep, so I lived in, what's that, Seven Pines? The light brown ones right here, or those mm -hmm. tan ones? Yep. Straight ahead, that's Seven Pines? Yep. Or Pinewood, mm -hmm. okay. something like that with Pinewood. Yeah, that's where I lived at. I remember the building. Okay, so this is the apartment, 1677. Okay, so, Jaja, you see? Uh -huh. So you see this side, the next side on the second floor. That's where I used to live. So that, I'm finna try to zoom in on the apartment. So the second floor right there, that was my apartment. Right there, and I lived there in... Sixth grade because I was going to Owls Elementary at the time, and that's when I set the house on fire in that apartment. Well, you set the house on fire. I set my bed on fire, and um, they had to replace my bed. Did your mom get mad at you? What you think? I mean, did you really just ask me that question? <laughs> you set it on fire on purpose? I set the bed on fire on purpose. But I didn't realize how quick it would go up in flames. I didn't realize how, how bad it would go up in flames. So this is uh, Darcy's Pint. They're known for the best horseshoes in Springfield. So I'm gonna get a horseshoe and then I'll let you guys know how it is. Well, the kids are gonna eat it, but I'll just get a little taste uh, from them. All right, so now I'm taking you to the house where I used to live at on First Street um, when I was a little girl. We used to, me and my brother Ray used to sit, stand on that porch right there to catch the bus to go to school when we missed our school bus, when we had to catch the city bus. But I'm going to show you the house I lived in um, actually when I lost my virginity. <laughs> and it will be this brick house right here on the corner. 1421 South First Street. That window right there in the front was my bedroom. And one day I'm gonna buy this house. As a house to come back to for vacation. Yep, it will be a vacation house. But yep, the same. My mom's bedroom was down there in those bottom windows. That was the dining room and that's the kitchen window. And that's where I had my dog meeting. I ain't gonna talk about him because I get emotional, but that was the house. Now this house right here was the house, this white house right here was the house that my brother Ray lived in. Um, we lived across the street from each other and it was crazy because my mom would leave, every morning my mom would leave the front door, door open for him, for him to come in the house and I would wake up and he'd be sitting on my bed. And that's the house and then my grandma Betty lived in this gray house after we moved out of the brick house and she lived upstairs right in that top apartment cause it's two, that's two houses in one. But yeah, this is pretty much where I lived at. And that, um, my window uh, that I showed you on the brick house, <laughs> I remember when um, one of my friends at the time came to spend a night and your dad, and, well, I keep saying your dad, but he wanted to come see me 
really late at night and it was January, no, it was February and the snow was so piled up. I think we had a blizzard and I couldn't have company. So he called me and was parked outside the house and then he jumped in that window. Jumped in my window and we literally had a party for about four hours in my room. I blasted the music. They had drinks and everything. And my mom never knew she was right downstairs. Mm -hmm. Never knew. Never knew. But yeah, this is my house. That's crazy. That's cr okay, I am meeting one of my sisters for the first time ever. You know, my dad got like 11, 12 kids. What was that? Oh, I'm going to have to get with him in a minute. Actually, this is my cousin, Mario. Mario, I see you. I'm, I'm going to get to you in a minute, baby. I can't answer it right now. But I'm at, Oh, is that her coming out the door? I wish I could have met Erica, but look like Celeste is the only one that's available right now, huh? Not really. Can I come with you? you and just chill here for a second. Oh, my God, there's Carson. That Carson? Is that Carson? That's Carson? Is that my nephew Carson? Hi, I'm your TT Chappelle. I'm not gonna go. I promise. I don't want to get a spanking. You're not gonna spank me, are you? No. No, you're not. It smell all good in here. What's that? That candle, probably. What's the? What's the? What is that? You know that new glaze? Yeah. What? 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 What's the smell? I'm gonna have to steal that. I'm stealing that. This glaze. Ain't she pretty? I look at. Oh, thank you. You know, I got my fresh inches in. What? I ain't got no inches, but you know this hereditary for us, baby. You know this. We all. That's one thing Reggie did give us. Man. What? And I got that um, texture. I should have took it right on out. Yeah. <laughs> so, no, I ain't got it no more. <laughs> oh, I know. Right? All right, so we made it to Chicago. We over on the south side at my sister Anissa's house. It's a lot of snow out here in Chicago. A lot of snow. A lot of snow. A lot of So, ring the doorbell. Let's see. Open the doorbell. What? Hopefully we will see, won't we? Wait, this is to look through the door. No, it's not. That's for mail. Oh, mail. And this is locked. Yeah, where do they have this part right here? Protection. We in Chicago. He asked him why they had the bars on the middle door. Yeah, but how are you supposed to knock? You ain't supposed to be coming to nobody else on the knocks. That's the point. What are you doing? Dancing. <laughs> what you doing? excited? Yeah. Oh, is that her? Yep. Stop banging on my dog. I'm sorry. I heard Hey! You. Oh, we didn't know if it worked. You know, this is a black neighborhood. We just checked. Oh, it worked. <laughs> Don't be a way back young. Oh, wow. Knock, knock your feet, Sean. Knock your feet off. Over here, over here, just, over here. Just kick it up against the wall. Yeah, kick it, just kick it. Just, just kick it, just kick just it. Stomp your feet real hard. Just kick it. There you go, I had a rug up here. I don't know what the hell they, this one ain't never been in snow, so he don't know. Okay, got it. <laughs> oh, that's okay. Yeah, they ain't never been in snow before. Oh, yeah, the floor need to be mopped anyway. There she is! Me, yes, I'm in. And you're going to be on YouTube and everything. Hey. Yeah. Look at the mess. Oh, hi, Paul. Hi, honey. Give me a hug. Oh, she ain't going to stay. Like this, so she, so <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> they don't want 
twin. They gonna chase my cat. Yes, they they act hey, y'all act hey, see this when you invite black kids in your house. Hey, they just okay, that's crazy. She just wanted to look at you. She good now. She I'm gonna put this right here. Hold on, cause they gotta get this yeah. moment. Who is they? My followers. I don't have followers. Yeah. I told you I was coming. I know. I said, I'm coming, man. Yes. You looking good, well, girl. Well, girl, I'm not bad. No, you don't. Yes, ma'am. Yes, we are uh, one of the hills, we, even though we ain't got the, you look good. Yeah. Well, it's yeah, in the jeans. The, yeah, that looks look, good. I look a bum. You are at home. Exactly. You ain't at Walmart. No. Folks wear this at Walmart. They do, don't they? <laughs> They, they wear this Point made. Point made. Yeah. Point made. Yeah, so. I told our brother. I oh, I just him. got on the phone with him not too long ago. Cussed him smooth out. You talking about Trevor? Yeah. I talking about him, girl. Which one? Trevor. Talking about Rico. What did he say? I told him I was going to FaceTime him um, when you got here. Uh huh. He talking about some hopefully y'all pick up. I said, nigga, you better not go to sleep. Well, but really? Yeah. It ain't even that late when It ain't that late. late. He's so old. Now he got a he got a daughter now. I know. I told him I said he was supposed to bring her over to go swimming. He's so fired because I didn't get a picture with him or nothing when he was there. Really? Cause he, I'm gonna be back. I'm gonna be back when they drop me off on Sunday. I'm coming back. I said, all right, Rico. Then he texted me say, I'm I'm at work, sis. So I said, Nah, uh, uh. Really? Yeah, Rico. If you watch this, yeah, we talking about you. Yeah. Cause you so disrespectful. Trevor know he, Trevor know he gonna be in trouble. He's with Brandon right now. Who is Brandon? Our cousin Brandon. I'm um, see, it's from the people I don't know in our family. You ain't met Brandon, that's De De one of Deborah's sons, the youngest one. Girl, I didn't know Deborah. okay? Oh, well then, point, point taken. I'm just saying. Point taken, point taken. Y'all really messing with the, uh, did y'all come to visit the cat or your auntie? Girl, don't make me you. Shy, get in here and visit with your auntie child. Girl, you got me feeling old talking about some auntie. Yo, you is right. auntie. You know how many uh, uh, nieces and nephews you have? I know. Oh my God. Don't make me feel old. You is old. We all I'm old. I'm only 26. You old. You past 16. You old. Okay, so which one the oldest? You <laughs> how old? 10. You're 10? He'll yeah. be 11, April 17th. Really? And he's a shower? Oh, that's a lie. No, he really? wants to play with the cat. Oh, you want to play with the kid, kid? Yeah. Say hi to your auntie and Nessa. Hi, honey. Hi. How are you? Let her know your name. Sean. Sean. Her name is Sean. Yeah. But I don't go to work in the morning. He just, I know. You, give me another one. I'm going to go to bed. <laughs> Thank you for staying up for me. No problem. Back to me, pal. Come on. 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 She don't she pick that up? Yeah. That's because she, no, this is the one supposed to feed her. Uh huh. And no. keep her little box clean. No. It's been uh -huh. like that since we had her. No, she don't like you. No, it she ain't. She love her. No, it ain't. rude. But see, that's why I don't mess with cats, because they got too much attitude for me. I should be the only one in my house with an attitude. Uh -huh. She did the worst. <laughs> she put the cat on the stove. Burnt her whiskers off. Put the cat in the, in the sink. And she ain't even denying it though. Put the cat in, mm -mm, in the sink full of water. Oh my lord, Jesus. She done beat the cat with a belt <laughs> on the counter. So she, she hopped up on the stove. Uh huh. While she cooked. She got on my stove. I don't care, Aunt. You can lay in a chair in the kitchen. Yeah. Don't get on my counter. Right, you right. Don't get on my stove. Right. And she kept getting on my stove. So I figured I can teach you. I Has she been back up there? Side, I can show you, but I can tell you. Has she been back up there? Uh-uh. She, <laughs> she burned her whiskers off. She won't go near stuff. She won't go near. To grow her whiskers back. Wow. But oh, this is what she followed her. Lesson learned, though. She dumped in my sink, so I filled it up with water. And dumped her in it. Kept dumping her in it. They got to learn. How many times you dumped her in the water? At bathroom is one thing. Yeah. yeah. My kitchen is another. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She done stepped on the cat, poor thing. Who stepped has on, not stepped on the cat on accident? On the I done table. stepped on a couple times. I'm just saying, it ain't like I purposely I mean, stepped on the damn cat. I, 
She was in the way. She chased her through the house. Yeah, we pray. We pray. Have no seat. No. No. Wow. What did you do the last time? What you do? You chased her through the house and you threw newspaper at her. Why did I do that? Though? I don't know. Why did you? Because <laughs> she was on my kitchen table. <laughs> and you tortured that cat. <laughs> That's why. Baby, I'm tall on you. The you. cat got good damn sense. Thank you. She didn't spot it, though. Thank she you. ran her ass in a circle. Oh, no. Thank you. He said it for me. I do not torture Precious. <laughs> we hear you. And her name Precious. She named her. Like the movie. You you torturing her like on the movie. No, I named her before the movie came out. But it fits because she abused. Thank <laughs> you. Move, Thank boy. You. Precious. Sure, sure, come here. She ain't she ain't abused. She waiting for me to go to bed. Really? Oh, she finna cuddle with you. I don't know about the cuddling part, but... She finna crawl up with you. Yeah, she, she gonna get in the bed. She kicks the cat off the bed. She didn't kick Precious off the bed. Tell them you, boy. She didn't She don't even know why I kick Precious off the bed. It don't matter. Why you kick Precious off the bed? Because Precious be on my knees. Oh. And my knees hurt. You see how she like to justify the, the abuse? It's the that's child. what abusers do. I have Look, I could abuse <laughs> you, but... <laughs> Oh my oh, god. Get out. She get out. Well, at least she's obeying because she could be one of those no, cats that look no. at you and roll her eyes. No, that's called fear. Is she under the table? She in the chair under the table. Oh, she no, she sitting on the chair. Let me see this abuse. Let me see this abuse cat. Oh, yeah. Hey. She ain't no abuse. She might miss at you because she's scared. Took a picture of this. This came out dark, so I had to take a picture with her phone. I said, Just send it to me. Aww. 
get it, but also let me show you. Do something with that same phone. The edge, the seven edge. Yeah, I got the gold one. I'm going to go. Yeah, I see you. It's shining when you came through the door. Really? That's why I say I know. Mommy. Yes, we are. We need the bathroom. Oh, you gotta, you, didn't I tell you to use the bathroom when we stopped at the restaurant? Hey y'all, we're back. So we gotta update y'all on some stuff. So, last y'all saw, we was excited. And we was on our way back to Chicago to fly out tonight. Well, hi, hi, and I'm fucking face, okay? We get text messages saying that our flight has been canceled because of bad weather in Chicago. So, we're technically stuck here. Today is Tuesday. It's Tuesday night. We're stuck here until Thursday evening. So, I had to extend my rental car, pay another $200. I had to get a hotel room for another two nights. That's another $200. So, yeah, I'm spending so much fucking money on this trip, I want to throw up. Oh, they got it. It's okay. Give me a bucket. I'm going to throw up. Like, I, it's, it's, but you have to look on the bright side. I get an extra day with my babe. I don't have to worry about, you know, rushing and get nothing. You know, I got to call the kids school because they finna miss to three, from two, three days more of school. So now they're going to be going a week and a half out of school. Um, and you know, now I got, oh, I got to call my aunt because I got to let her know that. <laughs> well, it's her mama, so, you know, Auntie, hopefully you're taking good care of your mother. Hopefully it's not a problem. I wouldn't think it would be a problem, but you never know. Mm -hmm. I don't know your situation, so I can't really say that. But I'm just like, it's okay. It's okay. Now, if, if I didn't have the means, thank God I have the money. Because if that I didn't have no money, we would have had to drive back to Chicago, and I would have had to call one of my relatives, like, look, hey, hey, look, here what had happened was, look, can I stay with y'all for two nights, me and my three kids? <laughs> we just need two nights. And that one going to work out well for me. It, and it wasn't going to work out for me because I don't like to, I don't, but my thing is not even that for me. I don't like to inconvenience people, you know, because nobody's expecting us. You know what I'm saying? I don't like, I don't like that, so... You should have let me drive around the corner Walmart right there. <sighs> she want to drive. You can drive back. Put your seatbelt on. So, yeah, that's the situation. We were going to stay at the Comfort. That's where I would have preferred to Man, stay. I to go swimming so bad. That's where I would have preferred to stay. Me and John was talking about it. But they wanted a hundred and something a night. And I said, look, let me tell you something. Um, I wasn't expecting to spend this much money because people got to realize, yeah, look, I'm balling on the budget. I have the money, but I do not have the money, okay? I still got bills and shit to pay. I was not expecting to be in Illinois an additional two days. So, show <laughs> rushing to get the hell out of driving all night, oh, sleepy and shit. I could have stayed a whole nother night, okay. got me some nice little rest. Okay. My dad would have been, I mean, he would have been okay. He would have seen us, you know, two, two days instead of just one. Right, know? like, come, go. What are you doing? I'm sorry. I'm just, just everybody getting it today. But it's okay, Mom. I'm just like, who? And then we hear some bullshit. I ain't going to put that on here for y'all, but niggas, roaches, and flies. I'm just going to say it. But you know what? The truth always comes out. WWJD. My thing is, you know, people try to make things seem like they're more than what they what they are you know and it, my thing is don't play victim you know what i'm saying that's just like you get in an altercation with somebody and you say you know what F fuck you slap me then slap me slap me yes i give you permission to slap me and then as soon as somebody knock fire from your ass you call him popo that's kind of like the situation i'm in it's not a violent situation but i'm in a situation right now where somebody said it was okay and to do something they was in their feelings and i have it recorded and then they got in their feelings and said don't do it but now the damage has already been done because it's, it's already done but now they on you know cry wolf it's yep it's one right here next to the truck though so now they cry wolf calling everybody they know who will lend an ear 
you know, and trying to make it seem like folks are the bad people. Man, let's 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 keep it all the way real. I'm not gaining or losing nothing with this situation by lying. I have no reason to lie about nothing. But like I said, the truth will always come out. In the end. Always. So, you know, watch what you do, people. But anyway, we about to um around the Walmart for a couple hours. Go to, yeah, I know, right? Go to Walmart, <laughs> grab a few things, because she needs some more, you know, wasn't expecting to be here this long, so she needs some more clothes. And then my, my little spoiled-ass son needs some headphones. I can't think of nothing else I need. Because they... I got my, my... You got body wash? Oh, I know, we need soap. I need to get another bar of Dove because I can't do that. I got to have my Dove. Dove is the only thing that keeps all this silkiness, this silky smoothness over here. You see how she's looking at me? That's funny as shit. But, yeah, I'll explain some more Can to y'all later. Can I blue thing and you push me? You hear this shit? <laughs> We're not even going to do that. But, yeah, I'll let y'all go. We finna run in Walmart and then um, go back to the room and... Go to sleep. Eat, eat our eat ribs. Eat and and uh, go down. And go to sleep. I'm up freaking tired. Freaking tired. So I'll talk to y'all later. Peace. When we get home to Vegas, can you dye my hair? <laughs> hey y'all, we finally made it to Chicago. Well, we've been here for a little while. Uh, I took my daughter to downtown. Um, I don't even know who this is. That's weird. But um, I took my daughter to downtown Chicago. She had never been in Chicago ever. So this is her first time being in Chicago. I took her downtown. She saw the Sears Tower, Navy Pier, all that stuff. So we rolled through there. And now we're at my spot. Hold on, let me show y'all. Yes, baby. Yes. You see it. About to get my entire life. Like, y'all don't even understand. Like... I've been talking about Harold's Chicken since before we even flew out of Vegas. So we finna go up here. I'm finna meet my cousin real quick. Get my love on and then get my chicken and then we out of here. I'll let y'all know when we get to the airport. Yeah. People like. That's a dollar for a week. There he is, y'all. Hey. Hold this for me. Record this moment. We gotta record this moment. We gotta moment. record this moment. Hey, pop up on my granddad and uh oh they did say this house caught on fire that's a oh, shut down but I'm finna pull up on my granddad if y'all are in the Chicago area my grandfather does taxes look like he on his way to the to there right now is Hills Instant Tax Service I'ma show y'all his little banner outside of his office slash home see that Come get your taxes done in the Chicago area. That's my family. We're all entrepreneurs. Hopefully, Rover don't bite no more. Boy, please. Shh, shh, shh. He don't know we're here. There he is. There she is. Oh, I was, I was popping up. up on you. Wait a minute, because I thought you went back to Vegas. Now, say I got too much going on. No, I, I was Can popping up on Angie? you. Angie. Ah, my back. Oh, my back. I'm sorry. See, I have a good time. I know. Are you in Chicago? You got on a I'm going to go say hi to Granddad. Yeah. No, please no. Hey. What's up? Are you? Wow. We, we wanted to surprise you. You did now. Come back here, boy. Now I know who it is. I think it was your look. Your look. Yeah, yeah. 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 Sean, John, John, come here. See, Granddad you. didn't even. He like, hold on. Yeah. I thought it was a. Uh, uh, <laughs> what's his name? Look at us. Get to you. Yeah. <laughs>
Give Granddad a hug. I know he big. home look at her down there she made it y'all she made it to Vegas y'all there she comes she's coming upstairs oh this has been a journey oh Jesus oh I'm upside oh she's no <laughs> that look funny my bad. Camera was doing some weird stuff. But here she comes. Yeah. Oh, I gotta get my keys. Look at her. She look whoa out. How was your flight? Did you did you see the strip? You didn't see the strip? Why are you looking all dead in the inside? What's wrong with you? You tired? What's the matter? You're lying. This is the, that I'm nothing is she's now. lying. Cause she's in Las Vegas and she's not smiling. So what's wrong? Uh oh. She gonna cry in the car y'all. I get back to you.
Rain Alley Beach.